See that diesel powered truck behind me? Well imagine if it was battery powered and you could fill up its battery faster than you can fill up a tank of diesel. Well, you're about to see that happen because right in front of me is that. A fully automated battery swapping system and that is a battery powered truck. Let's go see it in action. All right, this is Jamie from eTrucks. Behind us we have, what is this thing? So we've got a fully robotic battery swapping station in place inside our premise here at eTrucks. And this is actually working now? This is not just some prototype? No, it's, it's all fully working. Okay, so the driver's just swung in. He's got a battery that needs swapping. Yes. What does he have to do? What happens? Okay, the driver has to, doesn't have to do anything. He stays in the cab. Um, the robot has picked up his truck recognises where the battery's positioned, it will unlock the battery locking devices on the truck. Okay. And then lift it off and take it into the shop. All right, so let's, we're gonna see if this is faster than a diesel, because diesel's like, what, seven minutes or so to fill up a tank. If you're in a hurry, you're a diesel truck driver, you know what I'm talking about, you don't wanna stop. Can this beat diesel? Let's find out. Has it started? Here it goes. Okay, the clock has begun. Let's see what happens for, okay, oh, far out, what's happening here? Yep, so here comes the main lifting head and it's, again, it's just, it knows where the battery is, so it will come down, it'll lock into place, and then lift the battery off. Far out, check that out. It's got twist locks on, on the lifting head, which you'll see lock in place once it's located on the top of the battery. Oh yeah? It's swinging out now, as you can see. It all seems pretty sedate. You reckon this is quicker than diesel? It's pre it, it looks kind of, yeah, it does, but it definitely is. Oh, it's far out. How, that is a, I know those are heavy batteries. That's going to be like like eight tons or something like that? Oh, it's 2.8. 2.8 tons. 2 .8. Oh, okay. <laughs> right, yeah. not that bad. But still reasonably heavy. Yeah. yeah. And what sort of range this, this just shy of three ton battery, what does it provide this truck with on average? It depends on the load, obviously. Yeah, so this is a 282 kilowatt battery pack. Um, this is for Phoenix, obviously, um, doing the Auckland runs. Yep. But um, we've got trucks that also go to Hamilton on that size battery. Oh yeah? And they come in here to swap? They come in here to swap. How long has this been operational for? Uh, we've only had this running for a few weeks, so this is okay. basically the first truck in. Um, oh really? Because yep. beforehand I know you hadn't got the lasers right yet, is that right? That's right, yeah. Okay, so now it's and fully automated. It's fully automated. We were sort of doing it manually before, but... Oh I see, you got, oh, so there's the room for four batteries in there, so when... Yep. When one comes in, do they start charging? Yes, or are they? Yes. Okay. Once it's finished and it, it starts charging the battery in place. Okay, so... Now it, the locks will unlock and it will lift up and it will move to the next battery. It'll pick up a fully charged battery next. How long does it take to charge them while they're sitting in there? We can do the battery charging in two hours. Okay. There's four charges per battery pack so gotcha. this is the boring part because it it's is. taking a while it, it this is, is the part where the, the yes. diesel guy's happy because yes. he's filling up fast yes. right now yes it goes slow just at the very start just to come off the lifting locks here yep um, it doesn't want to damage anything so you've got to right. be quite careful we can have a quick look at the lifting the lock mechanisms before the battery gets here there's the contact and all that that's cool because I've never seen this this stuff before yeah it's always hidden away with a battery on yeah. top yeah here comes the just shy of three ton battery. So how is it figuring out where everything goes? Oh, it's all programmed. Um, okay. And you can actually, if, you, if there's a particular battery you want, you can actually program it to pick up the one you want. Oh yeah? Here it comes. Now it just slows down here just to make sure everything's in the right position, yep. which it is. Look at that, 100%. Spot on. And that's it. And that's it, your truck's fully charged to the battery. Um, it'll just disengage the locks, lift up. The truck will, it also tells the truck to lock its battery. Oh yeah, okay. So you don't drive off and forget. You can hear it now. It's yep. already told the truck to lock the battery. That moves out the way and the driver's good to go. That should have been about four minutes, 30 roughly. I think that was about four and a half minutes. Yeah. Far up. And so he's free to go now, I guess. He's free to go. And that's it. That's it. And there you have it. That is the first time I've ever seen battery swapping in my life. Not only the first time I've seen it in person, but a truck as well. That's right.
And this is real stuff. That's you're using this with customers today, right? It's all happening. It's all happening. Is this like do you sell these battery swappers? Yes, we do. So we've put it up in our workshop so we can show customers how it works. Um, like a lot of people have never seen anything like it. Yeah. So here it is. Come and see it. And then yeah, absolutely, it's it's for sale. You did a great job, by the way. You make yeah. it look easy. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Okay, so let's just say that I wanted to install one of these in my backyard yep. and annoy my neighbours. What do these systems go for? Are you allowed to talk about the price? Well, we can, yes. Um, we actually very lucky got funding through ECA. Right. Um, so there's a massive discount there for whoever wants to buy it. So right here, right now, we can sell this for $250,000. Oh, okay. So and it's basically a gas station. Yep. Well, installing gas stations is like two, five million something like that, right. isn't it? So that's right. What's inside here? Can we have a look inside yeah, that? We're not going to lose our heads. Wanna, okay, we'll... All right, we're getting a sneak peek behind the battery swap station here. Oh, so there we go. The, this is the... Oh, no way! Department. Tell you what, I just came back from a, a trip from China, and the stuff there has blown my mind. Like, obviously Amazing. this is all designed Amazing. and engineered in China. Yes. Like a lot of keys, we've still got this mentality that China is some 1993 backwater. But holy cow, after visiting there, yes, amazing. wow, they are leaping ahead. Amazing. And they have these things dotted all around the roads. Oh, so this is not like a, can I get in here? Or am yeah, I yeah. going to get no, crushed no, immediately? No, you're fine, you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> yes, Gavin, so my, my trolls will rejoice. <laughs> Here's your main control oh, so, board. Okay, so oh, yeah, yep. that's, the, that's the connector. Yep, so you and charge then, your, oh, your cables. Oh, I see, so you can plug a battery, a, a recharging outlet into the plugs on the other side of the wall and that goes straight to the battery. And there you have it. Thank you, Jamie, for letting me see a fully automated, fully electric battery swapping station for trucks. Not like real trucks, not little piddly domestic trucks, actual heavy haulage trucks. That's insane. So are we going to see more of these in the future, you reckon? Oh, I think so, yes. yes. All right. Very soon. The future, you've heard it here first, and it's right here in Auckland. Nice work, e-trucks. <laughs> <laughs>